Okay, hello fourth graders. So this is your lesson for Monday when I can't be live with you for reading. So we've been talking a lot about character traits and characters words and thoughts and actions and how they help us understand the character and what's happening in the story. So your lesson today is to go along with that. So if you look at the chart, it kind of puts together the characters words plus their actions. So on the bottom, the character asked some other children to read a book with her. Plus she also shares her book with the other children so at the end, I can infer from those actions and words that she's helpful, or excuse me, friendly, nice, and thoughtful, okay? So kind of putting all those together to help you understand the characters. So I have a little kind of a guessing game or activity for you with different character traits. So I have covered up the character trait for you, and you're gonna have to guess or make an inference based on either the words and or both actions of the character. So here's your first one. Even though Marcus knows the answer to his teacher's question, he doesn't raise his hand. How might you describe a character that um, acts like that? Hmm, he's not saying anything but from his actions. So here we go. I'm gonna cover up, uncover some letters. Here we go, it's a short one. So that says, shh. have you guessed it? Shy. So thinking about this shy character, what might they do next? Might he uh, poke his friend with a pencil, start tapping his foot, or try not to make eye contact with the teacher? I'm not gonna give you the answer, but what do you think he might do next? All right, so here's another one for us. All right, mystery character trait. While no one was looking, Diana took a piece of candy out of her brother's lunchbox and put it in her pocket. How might you describe that character? What inference can you make? So I'm gonna scooch down. Here we go. I'm gonna give you the first two letters. There's a blend. S Have you guessed it? Oh, there's that long E. Sneaky. What might the sneaky character do next? A, find a place to eat the candy. Take out her sandwich and sit down. Ask her mom to have lunch with her. Okay, sneaky little Diana. All right, next one. Instead of getting started on his work right away, Joey stares out the window, drops his pencil on the floor, and asks his friends to pick it up. How would you describe Joey? Hmm. This one starts with an L. Think of all those actions. Oh, lazy. What might this lazy character do next? Might he open his book, slump down in his seat and refuse to do his work, or talk to his friend? Hmm. All right, we've got another one here. The character says, I wonder what the first day of school will be like this year. What if it's too hard? What if I don't have any friends in my new class? You've probably all felt like that at some point or another. How might you describe that character? Here we go. We've got a W. Have you guessed it? Oh, worried. What might this worry character say? It's been a great summer. I'm going to make lots of new friends. What will I take for lunch? Making those inferences. All right, we've got two more. So thinking of the character's words. The character says, I don't wanna play that game. If you don't play with me, I won't be your friend and you can't play with anyone else. Oh my, that was quite forceful. Have you guessed it without me even uncovering any letters? I think you're gonna get it when I pull out the first letter. Oh, bossy. So might this bossy character, what actions might be next? Pull his friend over to the game Ask some other kids if they want to play. Ask a teacher for help. Hmm. All right, last mystery character trait. The character says, Miss Smith, can I help you help pass out papers? Also, would you like me to take the books back to the library? A character like this, how might you describe them? Think about those words. I think you're going to get this one. Oh, helpful. And lastly, what might this helpful character do next? Go to lunch, offer to clean the desks, or begin his classwork. 
So thinking about character traits, your project on the Google Doc for today is to use the app Pick Collage to create a collage of character traits about yourself. And I also attached a list to help. So if you were to describe yourself, what kind of character traits might you use? Okay, and I have some examples in there. I have a screencast. I'm really anxious to see what you guys come up with and what kind of pick collage you create for your own character traits. So have fun with it and I can't wait to see them.